Football Saturday here in the kitchen, which means two things. One, I'll be making muddy little footballs, and two, be drinking a little beer. The story behind muddy little footballs is kind of a funny little story here. Uh, Fifteen years ago, when I was diagnosed with diverticulitis, I had to change my diet. Uh, one of the toughest challenges was football Saturday and tailgating parties. So I created uh, some spinach rolls to take with me to a tailgate party. And me and I want to tell you, when my buds saw me unwrap those, they ribbed me something hard. I mean, they just gave me a lot of flack. Uh, but, you know, what can I do? I can't eat that, uh, the, the unhealthy crap. So, uh, uh, you know, sure enough, that first time that I brought them, uh, they grabbed one of them and they started playing football with it. And the tradition was born. The legend was born. Um, you know, Bob's going to bring the muddy little football. So let's go ahead and let me show you how um, I create these things. All right, we start with a big, uh, big old frying pan, and put in a little as well. Actually, quite a bit of oil. We're gonna cook down our our spinach. All right, once the spinach gets cooked down, I like to throw it in the food processor and just give it a couple of quick pulses. <laughs> That's it. That's all you need. Um, helps break it up just a little bit more. Then we're going to transfer it into a big old mixing bowl. All right, today we're going to try something a little bit new. Um, we're going to actually add some uh, kale to the spinach and see how much that changes the flavor. All right, we have the kale in with the uh, spinach, a couple of pulses. All right, we throw in uh, eight ounces of uh, Greek yogurt cream cheese. It's healthier. I like to get the whipped variety. And then in goes our spinach and kale mixture. And then just go ahead and combine the two. Alright, now usually you can go down to the bakery, you can find a nice little roll that looks kind of like a football. You then hollow it out, and that's where we're going to put the spinach and cream cheese mixture. Alright, just to give it a little bit of kick, we're going to add some sriracha sauce. That's all you need. And then we're going to top that off with a little bit more of the spinach mixture. All right, the final bit comes uh, by adding a little cheese on top. It's decoration. One long piece, kind of a thick, goes right on top. Press it in a little bit. And then you're going to make cross pieces that represent... And then what we're going to do is we're going to throw that in the oven and just warm it up. And here we have four muddy little footballs ready to go into the oven. You can also wrap them up in aluminum foil and throw them on the grill if you're out uh, uh, tailgating. 